It's week two of season two for Call of Duty Modern Warfare 3, and you know what that means, an all new aftermarket part. Today, the Jack Limb Ripper, AKA the Underbarrel Chainsaw. Yep, we are going full Gears of War today with this aftermarket part. We're gonna talk how to unlock it, what its benefits are, and how I think it can be improved because spoiler alert, it needs a little bit of love. So first things first, uh, the challenges you have to do this week are fairly simple, though you may have to build yourself a monstrosity of a gun. This is what I put together. The challenges I ended up doing were 30 operator kills using a different kind of ammo other than the default ammo, 20 kills with an underbarrel attachment, 10 gun butt kills, 15 throwing knife kills, and 10 point blank kills. Basically, I just took a Ram 7 and put all sorts of crazy things on it and uh, got it knocked out within two games in the small map playlist, and that worked absolutely perfectly for me. Now, once it's unlocked, it can be equipped like any other underbarrel, the chainsaw, the jack limb ripper, but you will notice you're going to get a 17% aim down sight penalty, which is unfortunate, especially because of the ways you end up having to use it. It doesn't feel like this is uh, an appropriate penalty for exactly the utility that you get out of it. So there's two ways to use the limb ripper. The first is like any other underbarrel. You hit the D-pad over on the left-hand side, and then you have it selected. When you pull the trigger, you're gonna get a hip fire screen up. It's gonna take a, like a couple of frames to bring up the chainsaw into a ready position, and then you pull the trigger and uh, it revs the chainsaw, and you can do that and chase after people. Unfortunately, when you pull the trigger on it, it's gonna prevent you from sprinting, and because it takes a couple of frames, uh, if you're trying to come up behind someone to use it and they're unaware, but they're just kind of sprinting around the map, you're going to have to play follow the leader for a little bit in order to be anywhere effective against them. Uh, the other way to use it, which I think is the more effective way, is going to be to use it essentially as a bayonet. When you equip the Jack Limb Ripper, it does replace your usual gun butt melee with a chainsaw slash. Uh, this is much quicker and way more effective than using it like the underbarrel, though I don't know why you would want to choose this over any of the other muzzles that give you the one-hit kill, right? That is the that is the appeal of the one-hit kill stuff is or of the of those muzzles is it provides the that ability to get those one-hit kills uh, to then sub it out for an underbarrel part. I don't think it's really there. So how could they make the Jack Limb Ripper better? Because at this point, I think it's just a novelty item. It's something you want to flex on. And let's be clear, uh, because of the sort of stupid stuff I had to do to get it unlocked, uh, the lobby they threw me in to use it in, uh, we, were, we were getting lucky. I do not expect you to be anywhere near as successful as we were in this lobby with the Jack Limb Ripper on a day-to-day -day basis. I, I, I simply don't. So, uh... I think to make it at all useful in any way, um, they have to add a little panache. Or they have to add a little bit of extra ability. Um, for me, one way they could do that is I think if you have it in that selected and readied position, if it then blocks incoming melee attacks that you are kind of uh, directioned at uh, or that you are facing. So if you see an enemy who is running around with a knife, you pull out your chainsaw and you use and you pull the trigger and then that way you can basically defend and counter that. I think feel like that would be one way to do it because at the current moment in a chainsaw v knife battle, uh, the knife is winning most of the time because they have a bit more range from you and because it takes multiple ticks to kill uh, them, they're able to just uh, insta one hit you and be done with it. So uh, this doesn't have an advantage over a knife currently, which seems a bit odd. The other thing I would love to see, but I doubt it will ever come, is a way to uh, duel your chainsaws a la Gears of War, but I understand that's way, way more work than uh, you would expect out of this one-off attachment. So that is the Jack Limb Ripper. Like I said, I, I don't think it's gonna be lighting the world on fire, 
but uh, you know, hopefully, hopefully you have fun using it for a match or two. Anyways, guys, if you like the video, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, and I hope you have a fantastic rest of your day. See ya.